Each Fast SC connector includes the following components. The Fast SC connector assembly with wedge clip installed. A 250 micron protective tube. A clear protective tube. A 3 millimeter boot. A 2 millimeter boot. And a 900 micron boot. Warning. Always wear eye protection when handling optical fibers. Dispose of any cut or cleaved ends properly. 900 micron fiber termination. Slide the 900 micron boot onto the fiber. Refer to the strip template and mark the 900 micron fiber at 40 millimeters from the end of the fiber. Strip 40 millimeters of 900 micron coating from the fiber. Check the fiber integrity by bending the stripped end slightly at 60 degrees. Clean the bare fiber using a lint-free wipe moistened with fiber preparation fluid or 95% purity or better isopropyl alcohol. Insert the bare fiber into the CT38 cleaver and cleave to a length of 10.5 millimeters, plus or minus 0.5 millimeters. The wedge clip is engaged at shipment. If the wedge becomes dislodged, squeeze the top and bottom of the wedge clip, ensuring the wedge is inserted into the connector body. A click will be heard. Option A. Termination without the use of a visual fault identifier. Insert the fiber slowly into the rear of the connector until a connection is made. Make a bend in the fiber to maintain connection. Squeeze both sides of the wedge clip to release the wedge. Discard the wedge clip. Slide the 900 micron boot onto the connector. Termination is now complete. Option B. Termination using a visual fault identifier. Remove the dust cap from the fast connector and insert the connector into the VFI. Turn on the VFI. There will be a red glow in position 1 of the wedge clip. Insert the cleaved fiber into the rear of the connector until the red glow dims. Make a bend in the fiber to maintain connection. Squeeze both sides of the wedge clip to release the wedge. Discard the wedge clip. Remove the VFI from the connector. Place the dust cap back onto the connector. Slide the 900 micron boot onto the connector. Termination is now complete.